Shantipur College, affiliated to the University of Kullani, is located in Shantipur, Nodia, West Bengal, India, and is a reputed NAC accredited time honored educational institution of higher learning, having a checkered history that arouses strong emotions if one looks back to the past, deep into its various moods and moments. One of the old and largest departments of the college is the physics department, currently having eight professors who are leaving no stone unturned in their determined resolve to carry forward the rich legacy. Besides regular research work and publications, teachers focus on student-centric learning. The six-semester students in their final year are making a beeline for the department to defend their dissertation through PowerPoint presentation. Incidentally, this is their last day in Shantipur College. This video presents the experiences they had in their journey to dissertation presentation on 8th of July 2022 in which they candidly convey their fear and shyness, their fun, their satisfaction and of course the nostalgic feeling of the last day in college. Hello everyone, myself Ombika Pramanik. I am from Krishnanagar district Nodia, West Bengal and also a 6th semester student of Shantipur College Physics Department. I have prepared a dissertation on the topic laser and its application. I extend my gratitude to Dr. Dipankar Bhattacharjo, the Associate Professor of Physics. He has supported and guided me in my dissertation work. Hello everyone. Tasmin Hawk speaking from Chapra, Nodia, West Bengal. I am a 6th semester student of Shantipur College Physics Department. I am preparing a dissertation presentation on the topic of wireless sensor networking. I showed my guidance from my respected teacher Dr. Anita Gangopadhyay and Associate Professor of Physics Department of Shantipur College. She helps me a lot to make this presentation more interesting and presentable to everyone. I am Shubhajyoti Mandol from Korimpur, Nodia, West Bengal. The periodic critical assessment that I got from my mentor, Dr. Dibbendu Vishwas, Assistant Professor of Physics, who motivated me and inspired me to know a lot of new things and helped me finalizing my dissertation work. I am thankful to you sir for giving me this amazing opportunity. Hi, this is Mundira Boiraggo, a student of physics from Shantipur College, Nodia, West Bengal. Our departmental head and associate professor of physics, Dr. Jyotirmoy Guho, instructed and guided me in the preparation of my dissertation work on gauge theory. Hi, I am Roshmita Shenrai, student of Shantipur College, Department of Physics from Shantipur, Nodia. My teacher, Dr. Atri Pal, ma'am, associate professor of physics, was kind enough to guide me in my dissertation on NV Center and Quantum Technologies. Good evening. I am Shubhashi Shen from Shantipur, Nodia, West Bengal. I thank Professor Chintharan Mojumdar, Assistant Professor of Physics, for his support and encouragement in completing my dissertation work. I am Jit Mundu, a resident of Shantipur, Nodia, West Bengal. I am also a student of 6th semester Shantipur College Physics Department. I work on a project, Supervolumetry and its application under the guidance of Professor Shubhad Choudhury, Assistant Professor of Physics, Shantipur College. I extend my gratitude to our respected HOD Dr. Jyoti Mohi Guho and all the teachers of our physics department. Without their help and support, this project would have been impossible. Thank you. Dissertations are key part of university degrees and can be looked upon as stepping stones on their way to research and systematic investigative learning. It provides students the opportunity to spot and pick out a topic from a set of many, to come out of one's shell and work freely to unravel and dissect, promoting independent thinking and honing their writing skills. Overcoming fear and hesitancy, students in the process fall in love with the subject in general and the topic in particular that fans and fuels their ambitions. Let's listen to them. Feeling much relieved now. My topic selection has been confirmed finally. Thank you, ma'am. Actually, I did not know PowerPoint, but after having learned it from my friend, my fear is gone and now I am confident. I spent several days and understood nothing. But today, I practiced all thanks to you, sir. People thought I was shy. Now, I have got a topic to interact with. 
preparing my dissertation, reading a lot. Hope it will be a good one. I feel nervous, but I have to try. Giving finishing touches to the wall magazine. I hope my guide likes it. It is always relatively simple and easy to speak to friends, interact with teachers or ask questions in the class. But facing intimidating persons who you think are in control of your fate in an interview is difficult and needs boundless courage. It is equally challenging to present a paper before an august audience or prominent persons of renown and fame. Shyness, fear and worry overtakes you well before the event commences. Your intellect says you can deliver well and come out in flying colors, but your heart periodically signals that you cannot. Negative thoughts and emotions pop up and it is often tough to keep your head straight. You feel nervous and often the smartest, neat and clean, polished guy ends up embarrassing everyone. Things get worse as you feel that everyone is staring at you, noting down every eye movement you make and are on their toes to point out any faux pas you might commit. To come out of such confusing, awkward and unclear situation, you should have confidence and control over yourself. You should acquire the ability to handle odd and unfavorable situations and these programs like presenting dissertation in front of a learned gathering and trying to answer questions shot at you that you cannot dodge stimulates the creative self within you. It prepares you, it guides you well for the future. Through active involvement in such programs, you will pleasantly discover your personality and acquire a professional body language. You would then become well-balanced, self-confident, comfortable and relaxed. You would forget to stammer. To the contrary, you enjoy the presentation through your wit and humor and win many a heart. I am making dissertation presentation on case theory. Case theory is a type of a field theory while Lagrangian remains invariant under local transformation. We discuss a bit of history before explaining what we mean by gaze invariance. We then define and elaborate upon various types of gazes like Coulomb gaze, Lorentz gaze and also how one can move from one gaze to another. We discuss the differences in between Lorentz and Coulomb gaze and as well as advantage and disadvantage of Coulomb gaze. The general form of gaze transformation of Maxwell field is finally discussed. I am making a dissertation presentation on the Raman effect. Raman spectroscopy is a type of vibrational spectroscopy that enables for straightforward structural identification to trace quantities of chemicals based on their distinct vibrational characteristics. Because of continuous technological advancements in Raman spectroscopy, the device has progressed and more applications are now possible. The aim of this project is to highlight the different theoretical approaches to study the Raman effect, such as the classical approach with discussion of polarizability and change in polarizability when the Raman sample is subjected to an external electric field. Secondly, the quantum approach that includes the elastic and non-elastic collision between the photons and molecules of the Raman sample. In this paper, we discuss about superconductivity. Superconductivity is an interesting branch of physics. There is a lot of application of superconductivity, such as MRI, maglev train, superconductivity generator, superconductivity transformer, etc. Discuss in this paper their development and their technology. And in the paper, we discuss and conclude some future scope on on this topic. I am preparing a dissertation presentation on the topic of wireless sensor network. Wireless sensor network is basically a wireless network in which sensor nodes are distributed in any environmental condition to collect the data such as temperature, pressure, sea level, wind, etc. In my 
presentation, we review the types of wireless sensor network, the application, the advantages, the disadvantages of wireless sensor network. We also review the mathematical modeling of the NNC process of wireless sensor nodes in the condition of charge processing and the further application of it. And finally, we discuss the challenges and further research opportunities of wireless sensor network. I have made a dissertation presentation on the topic laser and its application. Starting with the full form of laser and its difference with ordinary light, we will discuss about working principle of lasers, Einstein's A and B coefficient, population inversion, population inversion and 2, 3 and 4 level laser system. Later we will discuss about the construction of laser and its various types. At last, we will discuss about what the application of lasers are in medical field, communication field, science and technology and military fields. I am making dissertation presentation on natural biopolymer and its advanced electric and energy applications. This review aims to provide a comprehensive review on natural biopolymer based sensing and energy devices. The diverse structures and fabrications process of three typical biopolymers including silk, cellulose and kitten are presented. Finally, the remaining challenge and future research opportunities are discussed. I am making my presentation on NV Center and quantum technologies. The exotic features of quantum mechanics have the potential to revolutionize information technologies. Using superposition and entanglement, a quantum processor could efficiently tackle problems inaccessible to current day computers. Non-local correlations may be exploited for intrinsically secure communication across the globe. Finding and controlling a physical system suitable for fulfilling this promise is one of the greatest challenges of our time. The Nitrogen Vacancy Center in Diamond has recently emerged as one of the leading candidates for such quantum information technologies. Prospects and challenges for the use of NV centers in future quantum technologies are discussed. It has been a hectic day. You students have made wall magazines, submitted write-ups, prepared PowerPoint presentations and defended your dissertation. Most of you have finished well and strong. Congratulations! You stepped into our department with dream in your eyes. True, we could not fulfill all of that. Maybe none of that. A teacher's task is not to fulfill others' dreams, but to show the path in which one can fulfill one's own dream. And we hope, with your patience, never say die attitude and courage, you surely can. We just try to stimulate your intellect and give a tone to your manners. We set the bar high. We just nudged to awaken you, to bring the right senses in you, so that you can rediscover the indomitable self quietly sleeping within you. Whatever be the walk of life in which you are led into, remember the flamboyant touch of this department that has taught you to hold your head high in confidence and pride even in times of difficulty. The time has come. It's time to depart. Time to take one more look back into the department. I will miss my friends and the lovely moments. I'll miss my teachers and their teaching and I'll miss the homely environment there. The best feature of the department is once you get admitted, you get the license to interact any of our teachers anytime, even in holidays, and they won't ever feel disturbed. It has been a good three years and we enjoyed a lot. They are very interactive and helpful. They are spent more time in labs than the students. Often we found this very difficult to escape. This is my last day in college and I am feeling nostalgic.
lot of dreams, but the best part is that I have learned to dream more. Full of green, a huge playground, enough space to gossip and make fun. Miss you my college a lot. Our college life may end, but this memory will last forever. One, start. कब मिलेंगे न जाने हम यार फिर से सभी लौट कर अब न आएंगे वो मस्ती भरे दिन कभी हो दिल ये अपना कहे के दोस्तों I'm gonna miss my college days. I'm really gonna miss this place. I'm gonna miss my college days. Yad hai wo saare lectures humne jo bang kiye the. Proxy ka pakra jana hola fare kya kam kiye the. मिल के लिखना वो जर्नल्स और सबमिशन लास्ट मिनट पे एग्जाम्स की वो तैयारी हो लिखना वो तीन घंटे मिलता फर्स्ट क्लास कभी यहाँ तो लगती थी केटी कभी लौट कर अब ना आएंगे वो मस्ती भरे दिन कभी हो दिल ये अपना कहे के दोस्तों याद आएंगे टीचर्स हमको दिल से हमेशा याद आएगा कैंपस और इसकी अपनी दुनिया हो याद आएगा हमेशा ये आशियान Miss my college days. I'm really gonna miss this place. I'm gonna miss my college days. Bye bye guys.